Hello, my name is Jay Campbell with the Facts Guys for Right Facts University. Today we are looking at loop current errors in Right Facts. This video was recorded at 1280 by 720 resolution for high definition and is best viewed in full screen mode. There are several errors relating to loop current in Right Facts, and we are going to discuss what this means to a Right Facts administrator. Traditionally, loop current refers to the analog loop current that changes when a telephone handset is picked up or a fax machine attempts to signal a line to transmit a fax. From time to time you may see these errors in the fax util interface and fax history and they will also be reported in the Windows application log from either the right fax board server module service or more likely the right fax doc transport module service. The errors you will typically see are loop current detected. When RightFax attempts to go off hook to send a fax, it finds that the phone is already off hook. This can occur when two devices are sharing a phone line and attempt to use it at the same time. It might also be a fax board solution configuration error. Loop current failed. Fax board solution did detect current on a line, but did not detect a valid value for the loop current. Loop current not detected. The fax board solution was looking for loop current before it attempted to dial the fax number, but didn't find any. Loop current dropped. Loop current has dropped off unexpectedly while in the process of handling a fax transmission. Bear in mind that these concepts still hold true for T1 and FOIP telephony just the same as in the analog world. No matter what the actual error, the key point to remember with loop current errors in write fax is that at the most basic level, loop current equates to signaling. More specifically, the signaling between the fax board solution and the communication channel it should be using to communicate to the gateway or network segment it is directly connected to. Failures can occur beyond this point, however, the fax board solution and perforce write fax are only aware of and can only report on what is happening on this segment of the call transmission. So from a fax server administrator perspective, Troubleshooting problems with loop current errors typically start at the fax board solutions configuration and then move out towards the telephony network and beyond from there. Please check back for more videos covering the many facets of the RightFax software. The RightFax University Library is a work under continual progress and we will be updating often. This is Jay Campbell with the Facts Guys for Right Facts University saying thank you for watching.